The Only Way is Badger by Stella J. Jones and Carmen Saldana. Deep in the forest, something wasn't right. Overnight, a wall had appeared and someone had covered the trees with strange posters. Badgers are best, pondered Beaver. Be more badger, puzzled Bear. Whatever does it mean? Everyone was confused, but not for long. I'm only telling it like it is, said Badger. Everyone knows that badgers are best. Really? whispered the other animals. He sounds so sure, muttered Moose. He must be right. Of course I'm right, beamed Badger. And as of today, I think you all need to make an effort to be a bit more Badger. Gosh. Hang on a minute, spluttered Deer. I'm only trying to help you out, Badger butted in. Look, I've made a list. Number one, can you dig like a Badger? Ready? Dig, dig, dig. It's no good, said Deer. These hooves weren't made for digging. Evidently not, agreed Badger. I'm afraid you'll have to leave. Leave? asked Deer. Badger nodded. No Deer here, he chanted. No Deer here, no Deer here. I really think, started Moose. I agree, Badger interrupted. The wood's starting to feel more badgery already. Now, item two. Badgers live in burrows, so if you can fit through this door, then you can stay. Easy peasy, said the smaller woodland creatures as they skipped through the hole. Oh, I hope there's tea and cake. But some got stuck. It's no use, mumbled Moose. My bum's too big, bellowed Bear. Sorry, guys, said Badger. You just don't fit. So bye-bye, Bear. Move along, Moose. How rude. Outrageous. Badger beamed at the remaining animals. You guys are doing great, he cheered. I don't like where this is going. Now it's time for your best Badger bark. So take a deep breath. And with me, bark, shruff, bachoo, squeak, suck, rack, rack. Badger shook his head. That was terrible. You sound nothing like badgers. I'm afraid it's time for you to hop off, hedgehog. Bunny, you're banned. And beaver, you're a lever. The rest of you, you're in. Badger admired the black and white signs, his shiny black and white door, and raccoon and skunk, both perfectly black and white. Ah, oh, fantastic, he sighed. And then he spotted the birds, the bugs and the butterflies. You're too colourful, Badger tutted. Scoot, skedaddle and vamoose. And then he shooed them all over the wall. Hi, guys. You're welcome over here. Psst, we'll get you out. It's much nicer over here. Hey, cried Raccoon and Skunk. That's so, so much better, butted in Badger. This place is badgery brilliant. Raccoon and Skunk weren't so sure. Grab a paintbrush, buddies, called Badger. Let's get painting. If it's not black and white, then it's just not right. Badger beavered away all day. Isn't this perfection, he smiled. But no one replied, because there was no one left but Badger. On the other side of the wall, there was colour and fun and laughter. Badger stopped. He was all alone. Oh dear, he sniffed sadly, and he painted one last sign. I'm sorry. At last he understood. Badgers aren't best. Friends are. <laughs>